only on Christ 17 TV. Happy holidays, everybody. But holidays are supposed to be happy days. Spend time with your family. It's not supposed to be about losing family and fighting over bullshit and making it escalate to something that you can't take back and you can't get back. I'm going to show you something that happened in Florida right around Tampa Bay that's very, 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 let me say it, toe up. It's some, it's some bullshit. Check out this. A mom in Florida was shot and killed by her 14-year-old brother, as he argued, with their 15-year-old brother over who got the most Christmas gifts. They were at their grandmother's house near Tampa on Christmas Eve when it happened. 23-year-old Abril Baldwin was holding her 11-month-old baby at the time. Her other brother then shot the first brother. He's hospitalized in stable condition. Investigators say both the guns used were stolen out of unlocked cars. This is what happens when you got young delinquents that carry guns. They get upset. They don't know how to handle stuff, so they just take out their guns and start shooting, shooting each other, and one of them kills his sister. The sheriff says the 14-year-old has had other run-ins with the law. He's now facing first-degree murder charges. His brother is facing attempted murder charges. Now, let me just say this. Who's arguing about presents? At least you're fortunate to have something. Just because your brother gets more presents than you, you want to pull out a gun on him? That kid right there got serious mental problems. That makes no sense. That make, So you're willing to kill, kill your own blood brother because your mother was going to get him more presents than you? That's horrible, man. That's horrible. Something is wrong with the youth, man. Something is wrong with the youth. So let me say this. Not only you pull out a gun on your brother, <laughs> you try to shoot, you hit him, but you hit your sister and you kill your sister who is holding her 11-month-year-old kid. So now, you shoot your brother, you kill your sister, and she dies with her baby in her hand. And this is in front of your mother. Then the other brother comes out after you kill your sister and comes out and shoots and kills you and then takes off. So let me get this right. Let me get this right. So you're getting gifts for Christmas, but somebody gets more gifts than you, so you get jealous and pull a gun out on your brother, get into some kind of little argument, shoot. <sighs> wow. So you shoot your sister by mistake and kill her, so he comes out and shoots you. You don't die. And this is in front of the mom. First of all, why do both these young teenage kids got guns for? First of all, where is the father at in this thing? See, it's very important the father stay in their boy's life because when you don't raise your sons, they turn out like this. I'm sorry to say it. It's real. It's real. You got to be in your son's life when you have a boy. It's hard for a mother to raise a man. You know, because this kid was jealous over a present. This ain't even no real problem. Imagine a real problem what the kid would have did. I'm talking about this is your brother. This is your family. This is your sister, your brother, your mother, your niece that your sister is holding. And you accidentally kill your sister so your brother comes and shoots you. Wow. So let me, let me set it all down for you. The mom has just lost her daughter. The mother has just lost her son for a murder charge. And has lost the other son for attempt murder. So now she's got to raise her grandbaby. And she has no, no more kids left at her house. Because 
somebody got more presence than the other kid. Does this make sense? You're talking about a senseless killing? This is Christmas. This is time you bring family together. Not destroy your family by getting fucking mad because you don't get as many gifts as the other fucking sibling. So, so over some gifts, you're going to pour a gun out? And accidentally kill your sister because she was probably trying to break it up. Because she's the oldest. And you shot her and killed her with her baby in her arm. So the other boy retaliates and shoots you for killing your sister. Wow. You talking about never wanting to celebrate Christmas again? If, the, if I was that mother, I would never want to want Christmas to even come around again. The memories that lady's going to have. But like I said, parenting is a motherfucker too. Why do both of these young, young kids both have guns? And why are they pointing it at each other during Christmas? You're supposed to love your family, man. Love your family, not kill your family, man. No matter what kind of beef you might have, I don't give a fuck. A motherfucker owe me thousands and thousands of dollars and ain't trying to pay me. I'm not going to go looking for him to kill him. I just won't talk to him no more. I just won't talk to him no more. And I'm thinking, if there is a dad somewhere that, that don't live there, He's kicking himself in the ass like, man, all my kids, if those kids are all from the same guy, oh my God, talking about not being there for your children, <laughs> that is the worst Christmas imaginable for any family I can ever think of I ever heard in my life. It's tragic, man, and I'm telling you. Guns is, is these kids should not have guns because they don't know how to resolve problems without losing their fucking temper and shooting somebody. Y'all were better off put fighting. Y'all brothers, brothers fight. Or shit, take one of his presents. I don't know, but you don't shoot your family, man. You don't fucking pull out a gun on your brother because your mother like him more and got him more shit than you. That's, 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 that's horrible, man. That, that's horrible shit to hear, horrible shit to see, and horrible shit to have to talk about. But I got to talk about it. Because here we go again with kids. Violence among teenagers. These are teenagers both with guns ready to kill each other over who got the most fucking presents for Christmas. Now, I don't know about you guys. But I would be happy to get any gifts on Christmas as a teenager, okay? I'm not going to say, oh, well, my brother got two more gifts than me. Fuck all you guys. I'm pulling out now. Come on, man. That is fucking trash. You got to know how to, how to talk things out. Resolve things without violence. Everybody's quick to shoot and now everybody's dead in the hospital, and going to jail for a long, long time. Over what? You're going to be in prison, in juvenile, knowing you killed your sister and you shot your brother over some presents. Is that fair? To that little 11-month-year-old girl that your mother has to raise now with no kids around? And the... Sh and to even pull out a gun when your sister's probably trying to break you guys up because that's what a big sis going to do. Oh, y'all tripping. I can see her in the middle and you're trying to shoot him and you shoot her. That's probably exactly what happened. Sad days, man. Love your family strong, man, and never let anything come between your family that'll make you up a gun and kill somebody who you truly love. Even if you're mad as hell or jealous or whatever, 
That's not the way to do it, man. That is not the way to do it. That's not the way to do it, man. Family's all you got, and now you lost all you got in a blink of an eye. With that being said, man, it's Christ 17 TV. Love your family, man. We all we got. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. Comment down below. And like I say, every time around this time, man, I'm going to catch you on the flip side, man. Love your family. We don't got much.